staring at me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Any specific reason why? It's fun to have breakfast with you and wake up and look at you. We're kind of like regular folk now, you know? <laughs> oh, I wouldn't go that far. But I feel the same way. I have fun, too. Yep. Yeah. Oh, hey, Derek. How you doing? No, uh -uh, no problem. Next week? Oh, that'd be great. Yeah, no, no, that, no. Three days? <laughs> yeah, that's great, man. Sure, just let me know my schedule, all right? Uh-huh, okay. I'll talk to you later on. Oh, good news. That was Derek. I heard. What is the big news? Well, he wants to send me to New York next week for three days. Three days? Yeah, yeah. Why? Well, for the, the syndicated show, he wants me to see some people about business and stuff. Isn't that great? What's the matter? If you're spending three whole days in New York, what about me? Frisco, you know I got behind when I went to Mexico with my studies, and I'm still trying to get caught up. Well, get caught up when you get back from New York. But that doesn't make sense. I'd only be three more days behind. Besides, I have an exam coming up. It's crucial. I, I do have to study for it. Well, do you want to go or don't you want to go? If you want to go, say yes. If you don't want to go, then say you don't want to go. Oh, I'd love to go. I hate the idea of spending three whole days and nights without you. Well, so be resourceful, huh? Come up with some idea. Work it out. I just wish I could. Well, so do I, but... Well, you know what you'll be missing. What? Well, I mean, New York. I mean, I'm like this with New York, you know, I used to bum around there a lot, I mean. I know some pretty nice restaurants I usually go to and usually catch a few Broadway shows whenever I'm in New York. And, uh, well, I shop on Fifth Avenue, too. And party, <laughs> the nightlife. How are you going to have time to do things like that when you're going to be working in New York? Come here. I'll tell you. You see, when I'm around you, I've got incredible energy. And if you'd be with me, then I wouldn't have to sleep the whole time I'm there. For three whole days a night? No problem. I'd get my work done, plus I have time to play. It'd be great, I promise you. I'm sure it would be. When I'm with you, everything seems so much bigger and better. I still have to study for the exam. Oh. Oh, did I tell you about the um, carriage ride through Central Park? We gave it the off. I know, but I hope we're interrupting. Hi. You are. You are. What's up? Listen, we can't stay long, but we wanted to deliver an invitation to you two. Oh. An invitation to a party? Oh, it's better than that. Tell them. Yeah. Well, it's the furniture has arrived, finally. The living room furniture and the dining room furniture, and we want you to come to dinner. <laughs> Tanya, we would love to come, but are you sure we won't be resting anything? I know you're still decorating your apartment. Oh, no, that kind of work is... I enjoy it. And besides, do you know how long it takes to turn a house into a home and it's finally becoming one? <laughs> so, we'll see you there. Bye. Okay. Bye, bye I guess we said yes, right? Okay. your idea of interior decorating, oh, huh? I'd go back to school. Huh, didn't hear you come in. You still got your key? Well, you like it? Like it? Yeah. Well, it's different at least. Uh-huh. What is it? Well, I'm going to New York next week, right? And, uh, this is like a gentle hint. I'll try to tell Felicia to come with me. Well, it's, it's gentle, all right. It's, uh -huh. it's almost subtle. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, that, that's my picture of the Big Apple. I was saving it. I thought you threw it away when you moved out. Moved? Hey, look, I haven't picked up all my things yet, including this picture. All right, well, I'll buy you a new one, all right? What do you think? Are, are people in love usually this weird? Yeah, most of them. You think it'll work? 
Well, uh... Huh? Makes me want to go to New York. I'm not inviting you. Well, I didn't think so. Let's see, uh, we'll work on Felicia? Well, what do you think? Frankly, old buddy, uh, I wonder. <laughs> with Jennifer, public relations. Drinks with Marie and Andrea, publicity. Drinks with Eleanor, marketing. Now will you go to New York with me? Oh, Frisco, I, I'd love to. I've never seen such an invitation. Then say yes. I want to go with you, you know that. I have this exam. Well, we're not leaving till next week. I could spend the rest of my evenings helping you study. You're wonderful. Mm. You have no idea how much I'd like to go with you. Is that a yes? I can't. This exam, it's... Okay. Well, you know, there just may be a way. There just may. Oh? Yes, Sean has a very rare book on pre-Columbian culture. If I can get a hold of this book, it'll be a tremendous help for my studies. Hmm. You mean if you have this book, then you can go to New York with me? Yes, I'm sure of it. Mm -hmm. Well, then there's no problem. Well, yes, there is a problem. I don't know if the book is in Mexico or mm -hmm. Sean had it shipped up to Port Charles. Oh. And if it isn't Port Charles, I don't even know if I can borrow it from him. Well, why don't you call Donnelly right now and find out where the book is? Okay? Mm hmm. Mm. This is great. Tanya, this dessert, it's sinful. Oh. <laughs> well, it's chocolate mousse, so perhaps that's why it's got a lot of rum in it. Tony's favorite. Mm. <laughs> you guys eat like this every night? No, not at this table we don't. You're our first customers. Oh, mm -hmm. thank you. This is a beautiful set. Well, thank you. And the centerpiece is absolutely gorgeous. That was sweet of you to bring that. Listen, as I recall this morning, you said that um, the invitation had a little news. What's up? The kind that we would celebrate. Right. Mm -hmm. That's why we got this special wine. Mm -hmm. Well, then what is the announcement? We have two announcements for sale. Oh. You go first. Me? Okay. I want to announce that... Um, I have just received my permanent appointment to the staff of General Hospital. All right! Brother, that's great, man! I mean, that's wonderful. Congratulations. Hey, hey, I feel wonderful. <laughs> this is to my brother, okay? To his new gig. <laughs> and now, All right. you got to brace yourself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, Tanya. Oh, well, it's really not that special. What do you mean? It's the most special Tony, news anybody has ever heard. It happens every day. Not to us, it doesn't. It's special. <laughs> Will you two knock it off and somebody tell us? Tell us. I'm going to have a baby. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's great. I know. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so happy. Oh, mm -hmm. you did well, so man. Oh, we're right. very happy. Baby. <laughs> wow. Well, hey, man. This is a toast to um, the new. New Jones kid, huh? Mm -hmm. hey, wait too. a minute, I can't toast that. Oh, well, I can toast water. That's okay, that's okay. I'm gonna be an uncle. <laughs> yeah. Old Uncle Frisco. So how's it feel? Uncle Frisco. I like it. Has a definite nice ring to it. Uncle Frisco. Yeah. <laughs> you know something? There's a certain ring to this whole evening. 
Because we're all here together, four of us, and I'm with my brother, and we have so much to celebrate. Solid careers, for instance. And I think you can think of something more important than that. Yeah, I think you're reading my mind. Go for it. We both have women that we love very, very much. I think you got it. Right on the nose. This is a night we'll remember. A night full of warmth and love. Let's toast. My turn. Okay, go on. May we always be as happy and in love as we are right now. must have taken you hours. My fingers, they're to the bone I work so hard on this thing. But if you go to New York with me, then it's all worth it. Well, it's certainly the most interesting invitation I have ever received. Mm-hmm. I'm grateful. Well, I don't want gratitude. I just want you to see. Yes. There's also another reason we should go to New York together. What? Oh, the first time was a mess. When you were in the art museum, that guy attacked you and besides that you know we weren't very comfortable with each other it's kind of awkward we were almost strangers and i want to make that up to you you don't have to make anything up to me but i want to and this is how i'm going to do it we're going to start out with breakfast in bed oh, i'd love it and then we're going to have cocktails on top of the world trade center you know i've never been there oh excellent view you can see new jersey connecticut maybe even the mississippi river well at least the hudson river oh and this is going to be the best we're going to move on for high tea at the palm court with little pastries and cucumber sandwiches oh you can order double if you like mm. and then this is going to get you i guarantee you forget it what do you mean forget it i'm going with you do you mean that you're gonna go? You're not kidding me, right? <laughs> no, no. I called Sean's secretary. She has what I need. I'm gonna pick it up tomorrow, so that means I can go. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> God, if there was just one more thing that could make this weekend perfect. <laughs> What's that? Why can't it be a honeymoon? 